A partnership between the Forest Service and the Watershed Group Friends of the Cheat is offering folks a chance to experience the waters of West Virginia in a whole new way. The DEP's Brianna Hickman joins us now with the details. Jake, on a stream called Horseshoe Run in the Monongahela National Forest, folks are getting a fisheye view of an underwater world. There you go, bud. One more. First, the wetsuits. Harold, do you know how to put these on? And then getting fitted for a snorkel and a mask. And then it was off to the water and a new perspective on aquatic life. A lot of people just see a stream or a creek from the surface from above. Um, we're terrestrial creatures, so um, we're trying to introduce them to the aquatic world in a new way and, and to see what actually goes on under there. It's pretty surprising what you can see with a snorkel that you can't see from the shore. Horseshoe Run is located inside a national forest in a sparsely populated part of the state, and because of those protections, it's in pristine condition, unlike many other streams in the state that suffer from problems like acid mine drainage, erosion, and sediment problems, and high levels of bacteria caused by failing septic systems or inadequate wastewater treatment. So what we're trying to do is show, um, show the public what a healthy watershed should look like. And so when they're out um, recreating and, and maybe seeing some of these impaired watersheds, they can see uh, what we're striving towards and maybe some of the components that are lacking from those systems that have been impaired. But besides the educational opportunities and raising awareness, this day was also about having fun. It was awesome! Tell me some of the stuff you saw. I saw some minnows and a bunch and some big fish. I think a lot of people, um, they're not really aware of how unique this area is and how unique these species are. So what we're trying to do is immerse them into that world to come and enjoy and, and learn a little bit more about the awesome aquatic uh, ecology that we have here um, on the Monongahela National Forest and also um, within the Cheat River watershed. The snorkeling events are open to the public and take place at various locations within the Cheat watershed during the late summer when the water flowing out of the mountains is its warmest, relatively speaking. It was a little cold, but I liked it a lot. The Forest Service has been hosting these snorkeling excursions for the last four summers and say they've been growing in popularity. In fact, the day we were there, the group that had just finished up were asking about when the next snorkeling event was being held. This was the first year they partnered with Friends of the Cheat, and they hope to expand the program next summer. If you'd like to find out more, check out their website at cheat.org. For Environment Matters, I'm Brianna Hickman.